Okay, Shalom, Shalom, Kwam Yasha Allah, Koholoyim La, Yahweh Bashim Yahweshai, Bahashim Rekha HaKadash, double honors to our apostles and elders of Great Millstone who rule well that by the Spirit taught us this beautiful truth. We just want to say the water to all the Akim and Akwaf that's out here sincerely keeping the laws, the statutes, and commandments of Yahweh Bashim Yahweshai to the best of their ability. This is Yahanan Nawaf, just coming at you with another quick lesson, praying that it's edifying by the Spirit. And so, Wanted to do a quick lesson on um, the beard and dyeing the beard and, you know, just pretty much going into the scriptures on marring the beard, which goes off into um, destroying your beard or um, we're not to have lineups and things of that nature. So the reason why I'm doing this lesson is I, I stepped outside earlier and it was just this random lady. And she just stopped, you know what I'm saying? She was like, I didn't really hear what she was saying at first. She was like, I like your beard. You know, so she went off into how her, um, you know, she just stopped in the middle of the street and shit. <laughs> Let her window down. I don't think I've ever seen her before. If I have, I, I wouldn't know. But, you know, she was just like, you know, my dad, he's pushing 70 and he keeps trying. He's dying his beard. And she, she said she basically tell him to just leave it alone. Just let it grow. You know what I'm saying? Just moisturize it oil it you know what i'm saying keep it shampooed and things of that nature or whatever whatever and she she was like yeah it looks good on you and you know she kept on rolling off you know what i'm saying and driving on and um so it made me think you know well let me just do a quick lesson on it because i didn't think of you know the dye thing because i've never thought of dying my beard before you know what i'm saying like I, that 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 was even before i came into the truth you know because I, I did have a few grays coming in you know when i first came in but now it's just like it's pretty it's pretty much a hey, it's been taken over baby almost you know it's almost fully there almost fully gray i just got that top portion of my you know of it that's still black you know what i'm saying but um it's it's turning it's turning as 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 the months go on but i ain't you know ain't tripping on it you know what i'm saying i mean it's just the look that the lord won't have you know for me and that's it you know what i'm saying i'm not tripping on on, on no going because see a lot of men they do this shit because you know they're trying to look cute for these fucking girls or these women you know so let's get the scripture real quick and i was already into it anyway um the, the word mar let me come out real quick let me just come out let's uh leviticus 19 and 27 ye shall not round the corners of your heads neither Shalt thou mar the corners of thy beard, right? So let's go off into this word mar. That's where I was just at right there. And it's kind of like in a phrase. Shalt thou shalt thou mar? They have Sahat 87883. And it says to destroy, corrupt, go to ruin, decay. Right? To be marred, be spoiled, be corrupted, be corrupt, be injured. Be ruined, be rotted, be rotted. To spoil, ruin, to spoil, ruin, to pervert, corrupt, deal corruptly, okay? So pretty much overall, let's go into the primitive root. It says to decay. Causatively, ruin, literally or figuratively, batter, cast off, corrupt. So, um... I mean, we definitely don't want to destroy our beards. And this is something that, that really could. I know they have some plant based. You know, they got some all kinds of shit. They try and make it seem as if it's safe. You know, but I, I just typed in, does beard dye have harmful chemicals? And, you know, they got a few things that came up. Uh, it says, yes. A, now, this is the AI overview. I'm not giving no medical information or anything. This is what they have in the um, AI overview as far as Google. It says, yes, beard dye can contain harmful chemicals, and some people are more likely to experience adverse reactions than others, right? It says ammonia. So, of course, ammonia is in there. Ammonia can cause nose and throat irritation and coughing it and coughing if inhaled. Ammonia is used to open the hair cuticle so the dye can penetrate. The hair follicle, no goddamn ammonia on your on your face, bro. Hydrogen peroxide strips hair of its natural color. PPD, a natural allergen that can cause contact dermatitis. Then they have coal tars, 
Some coal tar dyes have been found to cause cancer in animals. See that? Toluene, if I'm pronouncing that right, a neurotoxin that can cause allergic reactions, birth defects, and pregnancy loss. And, and, and you know, we um, they, they've been, it's been lawsuits. Lawsuits have actually been won. But um, it's been on the books, man, for quite some time, you know, a few years now that um, a lot of women, especially so-called black women, have been, you know, catching, you know, a, you know, certain um, certain things. I, I'll just keep it that way. You know what I'm saying? Because that shit is not healthy to be continually putting that shit in your head every month or whatever, whenever you're going to get your hair done and shit like that. It's not it's not not healthy, man. But, you know, a hey, people go through a lot for that beauty, man. OK. It says. Um, Resor 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 If I'm pronouncing that right. See, you see <laughs> that's another thing. These goddamn scientific words. It says, come on, bro. A chemical that can impact the body's hormonal functioning. Wow. It says lead acetate, a common ingredient that can cause neurotoxicity. People with sensitive skin are more likely to experience irritation, allergic reaction from beard dyes. Before using beard dye, you can test for a reaction by applying a small amount to the inside of your arm and waiting 24 to, 80 to, 24 to 48 hours. You can also apply a light layer of Vaseline to your neck and cheeks around your beard to protect your skin if you have skin condition like acne or rosacea. You should check with a dermatologist before using um, beard dye. Well, if you got to go through all that, why not just let your shit just go ahead and be what it is? You know what I'm saying? Why not just let it be what it is? You know what I'm saying? But see, again, Jake run around out here and try and um, look cute and shit for these, these women. You know, the same way women go through a lot of bullshit to try and enhance their look. Instead of just, you know, they're going to get a lot of them dying on the damn table, you know, trying to get a fucking um, a, a butt lift. When all they got to do is, you know what I'm saying? Hey, hit the gym and, 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 you know, better their diets. Right. But this right here, I, I, I wouldn't definitely I definitely wouldn't um, um, trust um, Esau's chemicals and shit. Because like I said, again, a lot of those dyes, um, you know, over the years, they, it, you know, the, the science has been coming out or their science. Cause you know Esau is he's starting to tell on himself, and, and you know it's a lot of um you know shit that's been going on with that, and then you know you 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 kind of burning your damn hair out. That's why you see a lot of these chicks with these damn wigs on. They got that um that that George Jefferson man. They out here man with a, with a receding hairline man going to going to the back of their neck damn near. They damn near, you know, cause of all them dyes and chemicals over time that shit just eat away and it thins your shit. And, and next thing you know. You out here trying to look cute and your goddamn beard is, your beard is really marred. All right? So I just wanted to touch on this real quick. I didn't want to keep this too long, you know, um, but let's go back to the scripture. And it's, it's, it's simple, man. I mean, it says, Ye shall not round the corners of your beard, of your heads, neither shall thou mar the corners of thy beard. And I, hey, I will have to add this on in there, man. Why would you be putting some shit on your face like that? You know what I'm saying? With all these different chemicals in it, you know, just to just look cute. And this shit is so noticeable. It just looks stupid. I be seeing some of these dudes, man, with this shit, man. It's like, like, what the fuck is wrong with you, bro? You, you do know that that shit looks stupid. <laughs> you do know that shit don't look right. And there's plenty of more articles on this beard dye. Is it, is it, um, is it toxic? It says, yes, beard products specifically designed to color your beard hairs. It says they are safe when it, when used correctly. Always perform a patch test. Why you got to perform a fucking patch test? So you got to perform a, a, a patch test and shit? To, to um... See if this shit is going to be alright for you? If you got to go through all that, then I, I, why even why even deal with it? But, you know, um, you know, Esau has created a very vain society. You know, people, you know, they're into vanity, a bunch of bullshit. You know what I'm saying? Everybody out here trying to look for every young. 
you know, <laughs> that's pretty much what it is, man. You know, people don't want to, you know, they, they want to, that's what's wrong with it. With a lot of these, you know, our people, man, I, they don't want to get older. The grandmothers don't want to be fucking grandmothers. Cause they just like, they, 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 they hate even the, the, the word of being a grandmother. When they first become grandmothers, I, I know people like that. Like, what, what do you mean? You, you don't want to be a grandmother. Oh, it's just a word. It make me feel old. Like, okay, well, you're getting older. If you're not getting older, your ass dying. You know? And that's pretty much what it is, man. You you know, these women, they, they don't want to teach the, 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 the younger women how to be wives. And everybody just out here just, you know, look at me, look at me. As a matter of fact, you know, um, that scripture talks about that in... Um, 2 Timothy 3, men will be lovers of their own selves. 2 Timothy 3 and 1, it says, This know also that in the last days perilous times shall come, for men shall be lovers of their own selves. Me? Okay? That's one of the main points that I wanted to get in it. You know, men will be lovers of their own selves. See? So, you got... Niggas standing in the mirror, you know what I'm saying? Taking um uh, uh 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 you know selfies and shit, man. You know just, just 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 through, man. So as, as a nation of people, yeah, we're we're pretty done, man. But the Lord is gonna come through and and situate all that, man. It, this this thing is almost over with on that end. But um you know, hey man, leave the beard alone, man. Just let the shit grow. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You can trim it. You know what I'm saying? It, it, you know. But all that different shit. And you be seeing Jake be out here, man. Jake be dying their beards. They, they be dying their fucking beards blind. Like, what the fuck would you want a blonde, a, a blonde beard, bro? They got your boy Fat Joe there. See, right here, here here's one right here. Well, this is a, look what appears to be a so-called white dude with a blonde-ass beard. Why would you dye your shit that color? You know, some of them, them, them Edomites got, um... Let's see this one right here. It says, man suffers a uh, severe reaction after girlfriend persuades him to dye his beard. See, look at this guy's face, man. And, and you know what? I've had women um, run up on me and, and, and tell me that before. You should dye your beard. The fuck am I dying my beard for, bitch? I'm not trying to look young for you. <laughs> what the fuck? Well, you know, I've had people tell me that. Or either cut it. Let's see, though. Yeah, he's fucked up. Look at that. That's That's disgusting. Ugh. And it looked like he got something. It didn't work out for him. He had to cut all that shit off. See, look at him. This this shit on his face right here. He went from this, listening to his, his fucking woman, to this shit right here. Trying to look cute. You should dye your beard. Come on, bro. Be listening to these women with that shit, man. Why, hey, as a matter of fact, you should grow your hair out. Why don't you kill them goddamn wigs? Tell a chick. I, matter of fact, I, I I replied to a chick like that. They couldn't take it. Yeah, man. Hey, this is a uh. Hey, the, the beard game. No, you know what I'm saying. I be um. I you know they got a whole aisle for shit like this now. Because men weren't really growing. I guess a lot of these companies they was like, well, shit, motherfuckers not shaving too much no more. You know the razor game is pretty much about out of here. But let us let us get in on some of this shit that they really doing. They got um. Uh, you know. Beard shampoo, beard this, beard that, you know, a beard comb for your ass. They so Esau, he's gonna always get down on, on what Jake is trending. You know what I'm saying? When Jake is trending something, they're gonna get down on it. They're gonna put a product out because they're gonna get money because they know Jake make money. Jake is an influencer, and so since Jake wearing beards, of course they're gonna come at Jake like you know, hey, well, you know, uh, uh, promote my product so to speak. Here's another Jake. Let's see. Like, why would you be dyeing your beard, bro? Best beard dye on the market. See, and this guy right here, he probably get paid uh, monetary uh, uh, monetary value on YouTube. Shit, so he probably getting it in. And here you go. You got a before and after right here with this Jake right here. Like what was so wrong with your beard before, bro? What's wrong with the hoary? The hoary, that's what it's called, really, you know, not gray. That 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 you know what they call gray is really hoary in the scriptures. I think it's H O A R E. No, H O A R Y, I think if, if I'm not mistaken. 
So you done dyed your beard to do what? To 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 look younger? To try and attract a younger woman? Shit, a lot of these younger women they like a, a gray beard. Right? So I'm gonna end out there, man. I'm not gonna keep it much longer. I just, you know, the lady, she kind of complimented me on the beard or whatever, and she was just telling me about her how her dad is pushing 70 and he's dying his beard. You know what I'm saying? He, you know, so you gotta so this is just something you gotta keep in the cabinet. You know, you you gotta keep this shit on deck at the house. You know what I'm saying? You you buying a box of whatever this shit is every other. I'm not sure how long it even lasts. But you know, as hair grows, I mean, you know, it's just like um new growth. Just like if a you know a woman she tries to dye her hair blonde. You see white women like that all the time. They're trying to dye their hair blonde, but you can see when that new growth come in, that shit, you can see them, them dark roots coming back out. So I'm assuming this would, you know, if you're doing this pretty often, it's just shit overall to me. You're poisoning yourself over and over again. I guess shit, I wouldn't do it though. I don't trust Esau's chemicals and none of that shit, man. It's, 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 it's enough. We got to use this man's deodorants and fucking shower gels or soaps and whatever you know they got more natural stuff if you can find it you know what i'm saying i'm just saying in general <laughs> you know because esau man he don't give a fuck man you know you get to read that paragraph on the back of any box of this guy and it's going to be a bunch of words that you cannot pronounce and yeah it's some science some because some, they put they got scientists in labs that put this shit together and you got the FDA, they'll say, well, all right, that's harmful, that's harmful, that's harmful. But you can use it just if you, as long as it's not over a certain level of harmful. Get the fuck out of here, man. You know, but anyway, with that, I pray that this lesson was edifying. Kwame Shala and the Bible Boy.